Welcome to part number two. Uh, due to length of these files, uh, now after you have watched part one and you understand exactly what went on, uh, I have to say I could not join, merge, combine these files together because they add up to over five hours in length. Uh, and so due to this, you're going to have to watch the whole thing in two parts. Now prepare for the part number two. This is complete unpacking of the stuff I do, uh, still for a good explanation, because I became really negative in this part number two, I have to refer you to part number one. At least you can see in part number two, uh, the way I unpacked uh, the merchandise, everything from the back, the way I have unpacked everything, that there was a clean thing, that there was there is no dirty play or anything like this. Just the way I have stated, everything in front of you right now on a camera. Do not pay attention to the words uh, I um, devote to, as you, you're about to see, uh, all the watches you're about to see are going to be with the stickers. Do not pay attention to that stuff because of what I already explained. The stickers were done in a such a way so that the whole thing would look like it's with the knife cuts, basically. Convincing enough, according to MK Ultra Brainwash, just as I have explained in part number one, which you should see first, uh, was done to, to make me basically discredit myself. So welcome to part number two. All right, so I am going to do another round uh, right now. Uh, I will be doing, I will be continuing with this post which I have titled, uh, well, Newly Insane Slovenian Postal Package Delivery via Express One March 25th, this one here. This is what I will be doing right now. Uh, something I have demonstrated basically literally arrived uh, again at my home no, address. This is unfucking believable It's unbelievable, man. It's it, it, it. Literally with a guy uh, after I ran out on a balcony, on a balcony, I ran from the room, only I stepped on the balcony, the guy already disappeared. This is like, like a super fast action, it's like, like a operation, I mean, he drives with a speed, at the entrance, throw the package out jumps back inside of the car, possibly even have a second person, possibly even has a second person. Let me explain something. I did not explain here very well. This guy has a relative here also at Slotnik. Novo Mesto. This individual has a relative at Slotnik. That's why he probably left to the Slotnik. I remember when he would take me even along with him uh, beginning in the 2010 I think is when he got the job 2010 2011 I remember one rainy day when this guy would pop up and uh, he would even take me with him so there was no way for me to chase him into the village and you know video record the guy uh, because there is a route here that goes through the village so where this uh, Smolenia was and then it cuts through right there and um, and uh, you end up literally through Smolenia was you end up literally at this place here Slotnik and uh, this is what this guy has a relative also uh, beside that he would cut through oftentimes because uh, he Mali starting here, right? So uh, I am I live here, right? So he does make a route like this to this place. Yeah, oftentimes because this is a deliveries here in Ratej, Brusnice, and all that kind of stuff. He even goes to Shentierne through here sometimes. It depends what he's closer to. Uh, and then, or he returns back to the city of the Novomis, that's here, basically. So, 
also is a proof that I did identify this guy is he has a relative here in this place in Mali Slotnik. This guy. Um, this delivery guy that I demonstrated you, he stopped like this with the vehicle like this. I mean, this is crazy. Uh, it was addressed to this location here at home. This was the address. The same thing have happened as with the previous mail. Uh, he keeps delivering home instead of at the postal office in the Novo Mesto city. The difference, it does, doesn't make any difference. Uh, police opens it up. They replace the stuff. They switch the stuff. And basically, this is uh, this is the way it goes. Um, he, he, there is another delivery guy with a white van. He's got a white van. I have also identified that guy. I have identified this guy and that guy. And um, this is so fucked up that it's unbelievable. His relative that would sometimes go with him, uh, he met me inside of the village. And he stated me, this guy, this guy with this, this car, with this car, okay, let me demonstrate your car. He, he saw me with standing on a terrace, video recording him. He see me, obviously, recording him. He goes like this, next to the house. He does not even pay attention to me. Passes, see me on a balcony, video recording him. He doesn't care. Look at it. Um, this is the type of car, yeah, um, not the white van Volkswagen, that's a different one, that's a van, this is just like, um, like a, they call this a box car, or whatever, um, this is the guy who stated me that I, I have not even seen one, I remember his relative is, um, quite tall his relative is about like well i'm 182 and his relative is about at least like 185 something like this maybe even 190 i don't know 185 and he had like a dark bear beard you know and this guy and his relative this this is like totally fucking around with me during mk ultra uh, they demanded from me to chase them through the village while they suggested to me uh, this type of scenario, uh, if you will go after us, the only thing that will happen, we cut through, we go to Mali Slotnik, there is a forest here. This is stupid stuff. This is stupid. And why did they suggest me to chase them through the village? They, they suggested me to chase them through the village during MK Ultra because they insisted me that they will steal me a watch exactly exactly the watch that you see i have ordered here this watch so this is a totally totally um stuff that is total 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 psychiatric lunacy uh, this is the watch they told me i will never get yes obviously the watch traveled through the one express now i already know because of scenario that i told you that in mk ultra have taken place because of this stuff here and they demanded from me to really trace them through the village they they told me during mk ultra unless you will chase us through the village and manage to meet us and they told me this in front of the neighbors in front of the people here in the village laughing in my face while I was drugged up uh, with the police. This is this is the way the MK Ultra went. So supposedly I should just fucking run after him into the village. And then he would give me the watch. Maybe, he said, maybe I would give you the watch. So this is basically the stuff they treat you like a shit. Like uh, um, you don't actually really, you don't, you don't treat even children like this. This is a uh, stupid, stupid stuff to do to adult person but this is the way it goes in Slovenia so this is the way it is basically this is the way it is okay um, what I am gonna say to you because 
this stuff that I demonstrated you, the, uh, the, the one before, I have video recorded it on uh, right here, March the 15th, 2024. Uh, I was also today at the postal office, but this is totally irrelevant. And there were this uh, pieces here, this kind of stuff. This is a total lunacy. Um, you're gonna see me opening this stuff here and you're gonna see me holding in my hands um, this kind of stuff here two items, two items this this kind of stuff which is like for the swimming under the water with a smartphone this kind of stuff this kind of stuff they were fucking around with uh, doing insane stuff with these things claiming me that would be eventually this stuff here that would break this stuff here I did not even pay attention to and video record properly the whole thing uh, and something that I yet I have to do but the point about it is just as you see the color it's pink like this it's not supposed to be pink this a piece came with just as I demonstrated you uh, like this which is not really even and therefore it's danger exists that the water would enter in and it's something I was promised I will get obviously this is from somebody else it was nurse Yanko who played with this stuff no so if you say that you're you know People that afterwards you meet them, uh, they try to portray you like you are a schizophrenic, something wrong with you. Uh, this is not supposed to be pink. So this is going to be one more proof that I'm going to submit in addition to the video that you watch here. It's not supposed to be pink. Both uh, pieces that I ordered, both I ordered were blue. Just like this one here. It's supposed to be blue, not pink. And I did manage to video record. It was actually pink when I opened the back. It was pink. It's I like pink color. I don't have a problem with the pink color. But the thing is, I ordered blue. I did not order pink. And I ordered blue deliberately, so to say. Deliberately, I ordered blue. Uh, sometimes I order the same thing, I do it deliberately, so they cannot play with it. I make it hard to play with it, because it's easier for me to match mistakes and stuff like that. It's more evident when you order two. One, this one you see here, it was blue. And the other order, which also arrived in this package, the same thing, blue blue simply blue blue both are blue you see both blue look it tells you it's blue sorry i did not record that earlier blue and if i go here uh actually the first thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna demonstrate you this is one order yeah i'm gonna close that down and we're going to open this one here. Blue. So they are doing the stuff basically the way they want. And just play basically. Just do stupid stuff the way it fits them. And replace the items with the damaged broken items also. Or at least defective enough so that it would look weird and so on. Uh, my God, if you say stuff I am talking about, it's really literally used for intimidation. Don't be afraid if you ever find yourself in this situation to say it's somebody that now you're meeting that did something bad to you in the past during MK Ultra. If MK Ultra is going to be involved, because this is what MK Ultra is based upon. It's a pure psychiatry, basically. Now let's go and we're going to open this package. So you see. 
even this here is not the color the way it's supposed to be. You see, I like pink color. I, I have it myself, pink. Uh, they kind of figure out that I'm a girly man or whatever. And so uh, I think they hated absolutely everything about me. So everything pretty much bothered them. And so let's continue. And we're going to do the package opening. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and we're going to identify what is inside in there. I think it's a list of watches, I think, just as I demonstrated already uh, earlier. And now what I'm going to do is after we documented the driver, the way the driver came and just that type of behavior, I mean, just driving past house and just like you don't exist and stuff like this is crazy. He left this again on the seat, just as you have seen. Of course, this stuff does not go in a, in a box inside, but all right. I remember there were scissors here that were bigger. And so I'm going to use these bigger scissors. Here it is. Uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to do some inspection. I am going to take this phone down again. I'm going to go like this. And the first thing we're going to do this, like this. Package properly sealed everything. Like this, still there. Like this. Like this. Uh, this stuff you cannot open. You cannot open. I would not dare to touch this stuff. Uh, but if you pay attention to it, if you pay attention to it, I, right now I see it, this is not going to be even difficult to to reach to the items because one thing I can already tell you this is not properly sealed we have to document this stuff here already the beginning I'm not going to open here so don't worry about any of this stuff but you can see that this stuff is not properly uh, closed there are watches in here and I know that manufacturer the seller AliExpress is not stupid I know that I know that they they do take care of this stuff. I know that for sure that this is not just like that. Or maybe it was like this. I have no idea. You know, when the, when the police do the job, uh, they don't make no mistakes. They know how to whatever. So this was purchased on what I was told in MK Ultra. It's going to be. It's going to happen, maybe, if it's going to happen, if you're going to be lucky, it's going to be like a half an hour, 20 minute long sale. Uh, I will get to that issue. Uh, I was going to already pay good money for this stuff and I didn't have the money and I decided I would not buy any watches. And then it did happen so that just out of blue, out of nowhere, it was this great deal that opened up and uh, something like this, I, this is basically, it's a gift, all right? So like this, you got this here, you got this here, you got this here. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to bother with any of that stuff. I will just go simply, is this here, where is it blue? Let me see that, boom, boom, boom. I am just going to go here. I have not inspected this properly. It's going to be like this. So I do want to document this stuff properly, everything.
There you go. Do this. Yeah, I have to make sure that I charge this little phone so that there is juice inside in one all the time and all the time. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I will going to open it up here. Let's say like this. This is the way we're going to do that. I'm just going to do one thing. Okay, and now let's continue. Okay, we're going to do like this. And we're going to open this thing here like this. And this is it. This is what it is. I am not going to take everything out. Uh, I don't actually even know how the hell I would do this stuff. I would be probably really better off just doing uh, the two cameras, this stuff or something like that. Um, should I just employ two cameras here? I think I am going to do something like this. It's a bit late, really, to do to come up with a, such a wonderful idea, but um, I don't want anybody to to doubt about this stuff, and so I don't know if this baby is gonna hold on to it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put one more camera on. It's not a really good camera, but it will do the job, though. If it will do the job, I hope it will do the job. And so, I will go ahead and I will do this just like this here. I'm gonna put another camera.
the video record this whole thing. So basically that's what we are doing. We gotta use one more, there you go. That's the stuff right there, and that's what we gotta do. I don't know. Maybe I should just put this here right there. It is. So that's that. Uh, hey, that's not going to be any any doubts about that stuff I do. And so there you go. This will be half. And let's go. I'm going to take number one. And I know I better hurry up. 24 minutes already passed by. This camera, however, is not too damn good with this stuff here. So this is one package that you see right there. Package is uh, fairly well closed with the sticker right over. So, no, I would not go and open up any of this. Uh, what I'm going to do is I am just going to hear just like this. I always do it like this so that if somebody has uh, some kind of doubts, whatever. I don't want to go and open where the package is sealed because that's the stuff for inspection that is best used. So this is this is a piece number one. This is extremely well packaged, this stuff here. That's what I'm going to do. Also like this. Sure. Okay. And uh, let's see if like anything visible from the outside already. It's a very good belt. It looks like a really, really high quality watch from 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 the distance like that. You got a five bars of water resistance. I was gonna go. I was gonna buy two of these watches. As much as I'm broke financially, and voila, the chance opened to buy for really. It's working already, this watch. It's already in working condition. And this is the instructions I have. These are the instructions and uh, this is basically the watch. Yeah, this looks like a fairly, fairly new watch. This is like brand, brand new watch. And probably I would even say that this is the first new watch. I don't actually see really any signs of wear, tear, anything like that that would eventually apply to this watch. Um, no, actually no, because it's a plastic right at the top, so yeah, I would say that this is a new watch. This is a really, really pretty watch. I, I did not know these watches are so damn good. Now I actually see that this is, wow, uh, during MK Ultra, they would not 
they would not just, you know, you know, they are really, really, uh, I am impressed with this. I have to tell you that I'm impressed with this stuff. As far as the watch, it costs seven bucks. Watch like this at AliExpress when they run special. 650 watch is actually really, really, I have to tell you, I feel this is spectacular. It's big, uh, but because of this belt, because the way the belt is designed, it doesn't actually even feel big. And so I am going to make a little commercial here for AliExpress for this company, Smile. Uh, I would recommend this. Uh, it's big, but the thing about it is that um, it's got... Um, many of you are not familiarized with this stuff, but... Uh, it came to my attention that the Chinese water resistance, uh, the watches with the water resistance, Chinese water resist watches with the water resistance, was tougher than a Japanese water resistance watches. Uh, meaning that, and I met the Chinese politicians who got really, really upset with people asking about the water resistance that it only had three bars or five bars and so on. Uh, one of the things when you buy with the Chinese watches that came to my attention are more solid as far as waterproof rating than the watches uh, even from Japan, from Casio. Casio, Citizen and Seiko have based on one thing I'm going to say to you, uh, they improve the quality of their watches as far as the water resistance based on comparison with the Chinese made watches. This is true. The one inventor of this digital watches and stuff like this, Casio Japan, Japan is the best, number one by far. Uh, but there was one thing that was weak spot in these watches until sometimes I think in year like something 2000, something like that, when the first Chinese watches appeared. And those watches, the digital watches and stuff, they have really, really proven themselves with a very, very strong water resistance rating when compared to Japanese Casio. Very, very, very good quality. This is Japanese mechanism inside. It's a J Japanese uh, mechanism. It was uh, based on MK Ultra information I have. Miyota, who purchased the factory that was Japanese uh, manufacturer of this uh, watches, of these mechanisms inside. Because you see, it's, it's uh, analog and it's digital mechanism. The watch like this would run you even, if you would have a watch like this in 1985, in 1990, you would probably have to pay $2,000 for the watch like this. These are just a plain bottom fact. They had this big Rolex and all these watches, like a show-off watches. If you would have a watch like this back then, you would sell one more than what the Rolex, than what you would pay for the Rolex. Even if the Rolex, tell you what, if the Rolex would be $10,000, you could sell this watch for $10,000. That's 100% fact. If you would have a watch like this, you would. You would get the money. You would get any money in the world. It's big. You would, regardless of it, people will pay you the money. That's how much technology have advanced. That's how much technology have changed. The original company that was making this kind of mechanisms, at least what I was told during MK Ultra, have sold its company to Casio. And so... What you see here is a Casio Citizen. Some are writing even the Seiko mechanism that is inside of these cheap Chinese watches. Um, some people started to criticize that it's a low quality uh, glass on these watches. It's not glass, it's a plastic, it's acrylic. And I was even told that it has to be because this is equivalent to the G-Shock. 
People are actually using this stuff for swimming under the water. I would not recommend this watch for every day. Uh, probably not for the winter time because it gets cold and you have to put the sleeve over. Uh, and so it is thick watch, you know, it, it is thick watch in a way. This is a thick watch, but really it's not so thick. Um, I'm going to do a special review. I decide I'm going to open sport channel of the stuff that I have, the stuff that I do sport wise. Not that I do because I was financially, they broke me so much that I could not even buy myself a fishing license so that I could fish on the river, which is right under the house. And they did stuff like this deliberately with uh, deliberately a fishing license fee. They raised the fishing license fee to over 350 euros per year. The people from the local fishing association were involved in it. And when I say involved in it, involved in a torture. They performed bestiality on me. And so this stuff is just something completely different. And so, but I will, I decided we'll open a separate YouTube channel, something like that. So that I would share with people my experience, like outdoors, hiking, and also gears and stuff like that, based on my ideas. I would highly recommend you this watch for really 650 and in the, in the US, I don't know. It's actually even cheaper. I have seen an Americans have this for like, I've seen funny prices like for three, four dollars. You have price like this for the watch in the US. That's a crazy price. This is one of the most expensive. This is the most expensive mechanism actually that's inside is the mechanism, Japanese mechanism, which is analog and digital mechanism inside. It's crazy. I will press on the light button to verify that there is a light actually that's working. This watch looks to me good. Uh, I'm trying to say like brand new. I don't actually see absolutely any kind of scratches, any damage, anything on one. This watch has also come with a battery that is Japanese battery, I was told. And so this is, a, this is really, really uh, a gift. And it's a really, really beautiful gift. I tell you what, if I would order this stuff and I would pay more, I would not be sorry. Now, when I have it in my hands, I am very, very happy with this. Perfect summer watch. Uh, and also the watch for the, you know, spring and fall. When you go out there hiking and stuff like this, whatever you do, you go swimming, you can go with this watch. This is a good, this is a really, really fantastic, fantastic watch. Very, very nice. So this is, this is one product. I don't have anything else I would review on this stuff. Later on, I'm going to take some microscope and play with that a little bit. But right now I want to get quickly impression about basic about the stuff we had. This our watch is the name of this is Smile Company. Like I said, I will do a little commercial for uh, this people who sold me these watches like this okay so This is one. Now we're gonna take next one. It's supposed to be five pieces. Five watches for nine dollars. That is crazy, crazy cheap. And so we're gonna see this. Uh, looks to me fairly, fairly packed. I don't see anything that I would see that anything would be with it. Yeah, we're going to open this one here. Uh, 
Yeah, I've seen people reviewing the watches out there, and honestly, um, everybody's got his own way of reviewing watches, and I wasn't quite uh, happy about the way I saw people review the watches. Uh, so I kind of decided by just watching these people, I would do my own channel, not even to make money, because it's kind of a late for me to make the money would make a difference in my case. Um, but basically, when you do the stuff like this, maybe you'll be better off doing something you like. And that way, uh, think about helping people and you would, you would do better. These are the instructions. Are we going to put this stuff back? Oh, not yet. And, uh, well, here is the watch. Wow, uh, another piece that I have to say is surprisingly beautiful. This is surprisingly, surprisingly beautiful watch. This was my choice of MK Ultra watch. Uh, I see a hair here. I know that I have to pay attention to it. This is the stuff that prompts you immediately to pay attention to it. Okay, so I'm taking the chair and glasses off. And uh, we're gonna do, we're gonna do some of this stuff here. It is working out there. Hmm, as I see a lot of stuff on it, this did prompt suspicion in me. I see hair and all kinds of stuff on a glass, and when there's stuff like this is present, uh, I, uh, <laughs> they come with these double belts like this too, like this, which is like total, total luxury when you when you this watch the stuff I see belt and everything that man it looks it looks new it does look new it looks new but there is hair all over this watch like stuff but um well i never had a really outdoor watch or real outdoor watch and i don't think that you can have better outdoor watch than this i mean i don't know how much the camera can catch this but if you want the outdoor watch then, then this is like a perfect 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 outdoor watch this is really, really is a magnificent watch. It's green. I don't know how my, how much my camera is of use to you, but it really is uh, exceptionally beautiful outdoor watch. The only thing, the only problem with this watch is, is the size, uh, the thickness, the size itself. But what people are criticizing and people are criticizing how they cannot access the interior because of this belts here that you see is actually at your advantage because it allows you to wear one smoothly uh, without having any pressure to deal with even if you have a smaller smaller hand it will it will align itself perfectly like this you see uh, the thickness the discomfort or something like that that would otherwise be is avoided by this round in the back cover uh, that uh, rather uh, pushes the main um, body of this watch if you like box of this watch outwards 
and is concentrated on just this thing here, which kind of a feel like a normal regular size watch, you know. That's why I would say I highly recommend this product for you to purchase. I would say that these are these are the watches. These are a much better than what I anticipated products. A much much better than what I initially anticipated products is what this is. Truly truly surprising. But this here. This is what makes me a little bit, uh, you see the color, the way this stuff is discolored. Uh, this button here, suspicious. So you can turn the light on, then it looks like this, very, very strong light. The thing about me is I never press buttons, I never play with the buttons. Just really, really, uh, very, very beautiful watch. Uh, I um, I still think, however, that with this watch here, something is not right. Because the thing is that somebody took off this vinyl when compared to the other watch. Uh, let me see something here real fast. It's just, uh, yeah, it is the same thing. The vinyl, that one has vinyl. This one, nobody touched the vinyl on this one. Somebody was playing with a vinyl, with a cover, with that one. I can tell that. But I'm going to put this watches just uh, right over here like this. So in the end, we're going to... We're gonna have one more review with this. I'm gonna adjust this camera properly. It's the second camera that I'm using as a proof. Somebody's gonna figure out something that's not. And we're gonna put this stuff here. And we're gonna take the third watch. They are equally uh, thick. These watches are equally thick. I didn't get to that issue. Here, we're going to take this one here. The thickness really, really, really is not your problem with these watches. That is very, very true. Uh, it's like I was told in MK Ultra that I should just concentrate on wh whichever one I like because the thickness doesn't play. They told me the thickness is going to be all the same. It's actually exactly what I have proven you before I have even purchased uh, the watches. That's exactly what I stated you in the videos about watches before I would even purchase. Despite manufacturers even claiming different sizes and so on, I already knew advanced because of MK Ultra exactly what I will get in my hands. So. All right, so let's go with this one here. I think both watches are new, I would say, but with that watch right there, somebody took the vinyl down. They did not place one back correctly because you cannot, because the manufacturer only does that. Uh, this is this is a watch I would super highly recommend you. I don't have to say why. I mean, this is no need to explain. This is exactly the same watch as the other one was. Uh, what a beautiful stuff. It really is not as white as I saw this on the... Uh, on the... You know, on the... 
kind of a see-through. Uh, definitely, this is not a new watch. It's all scratched up. See it? You can see it's, this watch is all scratched up. So we have the first watch that is not new. The housing is all scratched up. Not a new watch. This is a used, worn out watch. Uh, I see here something like QC 2312. Uh, this is something actually I have to pay attention to. Uh, this is a quality control 2312. This is definitely a stolen watch. This is not my watch. Uh, let's see this stuff here. So we have a first theft. Yeah, this is the best looking watch. You can see the screw is also open. You see it? Let me demonstrate you. See it? Every watch has like this screw, you see? You see it in a position, the way it is placed in a position? That's the way it is in the position, is like this. And I knew it's gonna be this watch. If it, This is the most beautiful watch of them all. So the most beautiful watch is stolen again. The number of watch is stolen. So you see this, this is the way it's supposed to be. And um, I can place this here like that so that you can see this. And I also take the, also take the other watch. Yeah, the police was playing with his watches already and one watch is already stolen. The authenticity as far as this watch is new, now it's all on the question. You see this? The screws are basically, this watch has like a crack here and you can see clearly that the screws are like this, like a cross, like this. That's basically when the watch is new. This here is not new, this is X right there, see it? So we have a first watch here that is just scratched uh somebody opened up this watch and have stolen this watch and this is the best looking watch of them all so this totally totally ruins my experience when it comes to this watch this watch also clearly is used you can see even the fingerprints all over the place you see it possibly even uh, Scratched. Yeah, it's scratched. Look at it. The watch is scratched. You see scratches right there? That's a scratch. That's not uh, something that would have to do with the... Um, um, that would have to do... I'm going to take this, the phone off and I'm going to go here to demonstrate this stuff. It's got nothing to do with, it's an old, worn watch, stolen. So we do have people here in Slovenia stealing basically the stuff. We do have people stealing literally the stuff. With the vinyl, you can also see, you see it? This is exactly, exactly according to MK Ultra scenario. The best watch, however, would be the one like this would be like this. So this was replaced with a. Um, I am gonna use because I have another camera right there. Microscope, and we're gonna do the exam of this watch from a little up closer. So that you get to see basically what this is. This is this is a rack. I will request another watch.
I want another watch like this. They will not be fucking doing this to me. This is pure, pure misery. This is basically driving people totally, totally nuts. Check this out. Let's go. And we're going to see this here. So, do you see the scratches? I mean, you cannot not see the scratches. Clearly, this watch is scratched up. Look at that. Look at it. Scratches. Those are scratches. Uh, let me see if I can... This is basically what the vinyl looks like on top of this. They screwed up protection also. Uh, this is the watch that was in a possession. Uh, I am actually going to even check this watch. Uh, just to see if this watch is even the watch that I purchased from the internet because uh, because of the issues uh, such as uh, it could be a very very old watch it could be the watch like those other watches that I presented you that were actually the watches that were meant to be a first models basically even that kind of stuff arrived in the mail to me before they would they would use them during MK Ultra. Uh, basically, watches that were long, long already discontinued, if they were even ever made. That kind of stuff also arrived through the through the mail. So, um, something I did not check was the belts. This is stuff I have not checked properly. And here is the rear of the watch. So it's all fucked up. It's all scratched up, man. These watches are really, really beaten up as hell. See what this is? Look at that. Hmm. The best watch, yeah, the best watch. This was Yanko, Nurse Yanko, uh, a psychiatrist, the police, they told me. And if you will get to order this watch, it will come exactly the way you see it, like this. And when I ask why would that be, it's because everybody liked this watch. Because we all like this watch. So, this is a watch from somebody who was involved in it, and... Uh, basically uh, end up stealing my watch. Uh, the biggest uh, problem, one of the biggest problems, if not the biggest problem with this watch is, believe it or not, a belt. And this is yet something that I will go ahead and inspect once I am done with this stuff.
So this, this people truly, truly ruined uh, the experience. Uh, truly evil, just out there to cause damage, harm. So, um, Chinese did really, really extremely well here with this stuff here, but um, this here, this, uh, this Slovenian business, uh, this is, this is shit. <laughs> this is the worst. Uh, I would say to you folks, uh, buy it. I would say to you, buy it, man. Buy yourself a Rolex, man. Buy yourself better than Rolex. I wouldn't say buy yourself a Rolex. I did not know they are so good. Honestly, now when I have this in my hands, I, I, I yeah, this is better. It's better than what I anticipated, actually. I am, I'm surprised. I am truly, truly surprised. Folks, buy it. You're not going to be sorry, I tell you. Those seven bucks in the US, I think even five bucks, you have even less. They give you for less money than they give anybody. Um, that's because of investments. You, you hear me, Americans? Uh, AliExpress was extremely grateful to American investors. And I don't like the politic the way it is now. This is a stupid stuff. And this is one of the reasons why this watches, you have it for less in the US than anywhere else in the world, I think. So if I were you, I would, I would just close my eyes and buy. You're not gonna be disappointed. If you like Rolex, you're gonna like this better than Rolex. This, this stuff here. As far as the watch, big i think my wrist is like 18 centimeters it's not a big wrist i don't have a big wrist geez uh, this stuff here would not allow me but it would look like this it's really really uh spectacular stuff beautiful Close your eyes and, and buy this yourself. You're not going to be sorry. This one here obviously is not new. But uh, buying it, you guys are going to get a new one, I suppose. Make sure you video record when you order the stuff. American FBI was involved in this stuff and they were up to no good. Police. USPS, United States Postal Service, was involved in it. I'm ashamed. I'm ashamed to have ever advocated the United States of America. Honestly. This, all this stuff was involved in it. And uh, here we are. I'm age 52 now. Uh, I am pretty sure that if I would remove that plastic, there would be some other stuff that would pop up. Uh, I am not going to do anything like this, therefore, uh, I think I did prove the point that this watch is used with uh, what you see here, the belt is being uh, also replaced. Uh, mechanism, I think they changed. I think they changed the mechanism. Uh, this is old watch. This is a used watch, old watch. That's what they were playing with. And I'm not going to allow this. Uh, this was a gift to me from Chinese. Uh, and I will not allow this stuff. Chinese were very, very angry with the Slovenian side. When they would come to Slovenia, when it comes to the watches, during MK Ultra, they would actually scream on the Slovenian side to return the watches and stuff like that. It was like this. They knew that there is nothing they can do about it. This is Slovenia, basically. I had no idea it's a, such a toilet. Really, I did not know. Because it was so much that it collected 
throughout my life that I no longer even pay attention to it. So these are, these are the watches I would say to you guys, either one of this, I would say to you, do it. Do not, do not allow yourself not to buy this if you're on the market. This, it's all Japanese mechanisms inside. I don't really know how, uh, but I think that this is like super, super good quality. There was uh, arguments during MK Ultra about the quality of these mechanisms. Uh, it was only Slovenian site again that had light and light and light and light about absolutely everything. Quite obnoxious stuff. I don't think Slovenian side would get three jack. I don't think they would allow one anywhere. Uh, but because of my involvement in it, they found themselves on a picture and were doing the stuff that is totally, totally crazy. They allow themselves far too much and they continue to allow themselves. Checking this screwdriver. Even the screwdriver came along this watch. But this watch, however, is more expensive. Uh, but it's also worth every penny. This is... I think... You cannot go wrong. This is the watch that you can buy at AliExpress for about six bucks also. When they put the discount and stuff like this, that you can go and you can buy at six dollars. In fact, I'm going to go and I'm going to do a promotion for AliExpress today at the end of this video. Because I really want to thank, to, to thank them for this. So, it's got the belt that is very heavy belt, very, very solid. The belt itself is very sophisticated, but from far away, I can already tell you this is not my belt and this is not my watch because of the dirt. See all the dirt inside? Look at the dirt. Look how fucking dirty this stuff is. And we are exactly, exactly the same again uh, in MK Ultra. They told me it's going to be like this so that you're going to know, you're going to see it from far away already that, that, that the watch was open and stuff like this. So again, uh, I believe that once I'm going to open this watch, it's going to be all kinds of uh, problems with this watch. All kinds of uh, issues are going to be with this watch. But so, very solid, very heavy. And if you were to have a Casio like this, you would actually even have to pay, because they come with the plastic, you know, you would have to pay some, I don't know how much one guy suggested that he paid for the, for the special case that you put inside, like a metal case. This is fucking fantastic. Eh? Very, very, very much recommended. You're not going to get Casio like this for like, five six dollars they they have one on sale five six bucks folks i don't know the price is higher than that but if you pay five six bucks for it this is crazy cheap um i know that this is not from manufacturer because they treat stuff different I know that. Uh, look, look how this stuff is glued. This is like in Slovenia, you know, this is a this is this is the Slovenian way, you know. It's like nervously, nervously wrapped like this. It's just like this, basically. This is a Slovenian way. You can see it right away. No, nobody, no seller, nobody does the stuff like this because people are totally aware about that they depend on the customers they don't do this stuff like this this is a slovenian way this stuff uh, look at the tape look 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 how dirty the tape is probably the tape really good for the fingerprints but the police investigators they placed me they used my mother to throw me uh 
silicon um, the rubber gloves for me to uh, use to remind me for which I already told you this is like full of fingerprints look at that they really work hard with this Mr. Robert Golop of the Slovenian Prime Minister insisted would uh, have watches always whenever the watches would arrive to Slovenia deliver to the parliament where the parliamentarians would look at the watches that I purchased and that kind of stuff which is kind of really totally fucking crazy but these are the issues they have used to drive insane so look at that this looks like uh, let's see what the fuck look Why would anybody even put this stuff in here? I'm gonna put this back here like this. I'm gonna do that. The belt like this, if you were to purchase the belt like this, I have no idea how much the belt would cost because this is a real metal, uh, really, really top of the line belt. And I do not know why the belt would be so... I'm going to see this stuff here. Uh, it is because it's it's uh, you can see it's scratched up here no. Even appears a bit rusty basically Look at that that's a housing from the watch and That sucks it's uh, scratched yeah, this is the watch for which police investigator have stated me that look at it scratched police investigator have stated me that this is the watch if i would purchase nobody would touch and they simply would not touch this watch it looks like somebody hammer one on the side too <laughs> He stated, uh, if you're going to order one like this, uh, it will be like new so that you will at least have one good watch. So I don't know what exactly he meant by this because I can clearly see that the watch is fucked up. What exactly he was talking about, I do not know. New watch? No, this is not new. Somebody hammered the belt. I can see there is a hole right there too. They don't make watches like this. They don't make belts like that. So I knew immediately when I saw that dirt, uh, exactly as I also was told that in MK Ultra the case is going to be, to pay attention to when you see it that you will immediately recognize that the watch is fucked up uh, do you see that you see what the housing looks like on this side look at it like the rats ate that uh, housing right there it's not like this on the other side and then when you look at this then you know that something is wrong i am actually even afraid to look what the cover in the back looks like but it looks uh, already from far away you can see all fucked up just not only like this but actually as if somebody hammered this uh, 
as if somebody was using a hammer. Look at that. It uh, seems like uh, they have a heavy duty hammers using on these watches. Doesn't look to them pretty. Uh, maybe the cover did not go properly and it was the hammer they needed to smack one so they could screw the screws inside. At least is, this is how they do in Slovenia, the Slovenian way. Uh, I don't have to say anything about right whether this watch is used or it's not used, it's all scratched up, fucked up. Um, well, this must be the worst watch yet. This watch is not worth it shit. Uh, some screws are turned like that, some screws are turned whichever way. My god, this, uh, this is a 5 bar water resistant watch, just like the other one. I would not dare to use any of these watches. The prettiest watches are fucked up. Um, this is basically what one looks from up front. It's all fucked up. Scratched plastic, basically. I don't even need the fucking microscope. This watch belonged to some security officer. This was not the watch from the police, but uh, police also had security officers involved in it. They would hire uh, security, private security. And it was one guy who had really a lack of education and was really for my standards, like semi-retarded. And this is it. I'm going, I have his watch. Hooray. This is it. Look at that. Uh, he destroyed the watch very shortly. Uh, he didn't need much time to destroy the watch when the police already warned him that he did enough damage that he had to return the watch. So that I would have uh, his masterpiece basically this is not the masterpiece from what I purchased but this is from the Slovenian police these are the psychiatric watches this is basically sadistic stuff you know and if you pay attention to yeah really the two bright light beautiful watches are destroyed I would not accept any of these watches, really. I would demand uh, more explanation once I launch this investigation. This is not okay. This is fucked up. This is all, all this stuff is all fucked up. None of it is okay. So apparently there was also other people they would give chance to destroy stuff and uh, basically then remind me of craziness they enforced during MK Ultra. So this is what this is. He had this watch not too long. He had this watch for about, he didn't have this watch for too long. He had this watch, you know, for about, um, uh, maybe even three months two months something like this three months I would give he was changing also the belt because the belt is all fucked up you can see that this is not the belt from the watch you can see by this holes here that he was really really handy with the changing watch because it's a cheap watch you know you get for not a lot of money in Slovenia, they have a big salaries people. In Slovenia's police officers, they make three, four thousand euros cash. And uh, psychiatrists used to make four thousand uh, euros in, I don't know, what year was it? I have written on the blog. And so this is nothing, you know, this, they, they go, they buy themselves, you know very very wealthy people so here you can also see the watch is all fucked up here look at this it seems like he was using also a hammer to strain the body from the watch a little bit 
yeah yeah right there you see how it's not exactly aligned uh, no that stuff maybe is the way the watch is done that's that's nothing wrong with it that was my mistake here is dirty you can see on the side forgot to clean this up a little bit yeah it's all good uh, the belt the belt uh, the belt uh, the belt looks like this the belt is all fucked up like this it's a beautiful belt yeah except that this one is on worded shit because the way he did with the belt look at look what the fuck this is the belt is also all oxidated which tells me that somebody was doing his best to remove the fingerprints the police was the one that were using the alcohol i told you a rubber alcohol to do that stuff and they would also do this stuff so that the anything that is metal would go within like uh, 14 days i think within 14 days it turned uh, rusty basically it just turns nasty basically you cannot even turn these belts because it's all fucked up look the way it stands up and so you have to do it like this and now you're going to hear how it's going to prick like this so uh, this is all for this is so fucked up that i'm not going to even touch this watch sorry it's just i'm going to put this somewhere on the side and that's basically is going to be it uh, but i'm going to say to aliexpress thank you very much for a beautiful gift uh, it's got five bars and I was really going to use this as a main watch. I don't have to worry about it anymore now because watch is all fucked up, obviously. Uh, looking at the band here. Yeah, the band actually looks good from this side it actually looks good <clears throat> yeah scratch this fuck eh? this side is clean when you look at inside but this one here is not clean when you look at inside
Uh, I can see some people from India here right now again. And they were arguing with them that this is the way it is. This is the way the watch was. And I don't know what. Uh, Indian people did not like them even a little bit. Talking about the Slovenian police. They also had, just like Chinese, they had a problem. It could be the belt is from India. In uh, India, they make uh, good belts. Wow, that would be a big mistake. Oh, what a crazy stuff this is, boy. Instead of using the fucking thing, you have to go and do the stuff like this. Hey, this is, this is really... What a waste of time. Slovenian masterpieces. For this uh, watch, uh, I was actually told for this exclusive watch, I was even told uh, something else, uh, which is completely, completely out of touch uh, with the reality. Totally out of touch with reality. Completely, completely. Totally, totally out of touch with reality. It's a stupid shit. Uh, the whole story about this watch is like this. The whole story about this watch is that the whole, whole, whole story about it. This, I'm wasting my fucking time on it. This watch is used, uh, nothing other than used. That's all there is to it. Uh, just as I have stated earlier, this is a used watch. The security guy was using this watch. Uh, period. There is nothing else I want to add to this stuff. There is nothing here to add. Nothing. Watch is also uh, scratched uh, on the surface, just as it would be normally if you use this watch for two months. Uh, then the watch would be like this, you know. It's a normal thing, I mean. Except that this is not a new watch. And it's a really question how long this watch has been in the use. One thing is the belt, uh, another one is the watch, uh, you can change the mechanism inside and so on, and so forth. What police was doing really with this stuff here is uh, something I would not, uh, I would not want to go and guess. Uh, it doesn't make me any fucking sense. The point I have already made is the point is proven. I may take a microscope in my hands and do a little closer check of this watch.
I was already very, very happy. I'm going to get the beautiful belt. What a beautiful belt this is. Really, guys? Uh, highly, highly recommend this watch. And uh, boy, 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 have I made a mistake. Boy, did I screw myself for thinking that way. Uh, traces of rubber alcohol are used uh, to remove a sweat. Totally, totally police procedure. I told you also I was not the only individual police was doing this stuff to... I told you that police was doing also this to other people in Slovenia also. A police investigator told me that he has another guy like myself. These are criminals, this is not a police. I'm basically investigating right now criminals wearing police badges. This is what this is about. Make good money out of it for causing people harm, damage. Uh, it appears that this here was removed. If you pay closer attention, this one here is the one that is affected the most. He did not even bother to use this side. He was using this side here to remove, to adjust the belt. And so it should be also this side here that could uh, have uh, some uh, marks on it too. Um, I don't know. They were arguing with uh, people from India about this here, big time. Uh, so I don't know uh, about new and not new and so on and so forth. Uh, is it that this is like a very, very irregular uh, piece? Uh, I doubt it. I would say that this is the stuff that was uh, used, worn out, uh, and clearly this shift here, as we say, is a strong testament to it. Is uh, somebody was uh, using one to remove to reduce the size of the belt. I, I don't know how big this thing is or whatever. And so this is what it looks like from the inside without my even bothering myself to take. It does not have anything in the back, vinyl or anything like this, nothing. And you know that this is a Panars is the name of this watch. 
you know, this is bullshit and that this is not a new watch because this company, Panaris, is actually a very good company also. They pay a very, 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 very strong attention to detail also. A very, very detailed company. They don't do a lousy shit like this. So we have a psychiatric watch here. A bit hard to video record, uh, maybe exactly because of this light here. Let's see if we can do better now. I uh, just need one shot so for you to see what the hell this shit looks like. So we, we do understand each other that this is not a new watch and that I will not be wasting no fucking time on the rest of it. I would not go in the water with this watch. This is a five atmosphere water resistance watch. It would be a suicide mission. Not because the watch is made poorly. I highly recommend you this watch. You're never going to get anything similar to this watch, but the watch I have paid for is stolen by the Slovenian police, according to the psychiatric scenario used to drive me insane. So we're going to put this on the side. We're going to move this. Um, so I, I hope I did video recorded this here. Let me see here. Is this, this is the one, right? This is this here. Uh, it says here, Sinoc Electronic. Okay. That's what this is like. All right. So, I at least I think this was it. So, we still I still have more. They give you even a screwdriver. Nice. Thank you very much. Uh, really, really great attention to the detail. It says here Sinoc. It's uh, it says Sinoc here. Uh, the brand, however, is Panars. It could be the same. I don't know. I don't know. But it just looks like the one from MK Ultra with this stuff. I remember this still. So it could be very well that this is also proof that this is not the watch that I ordered. Actually, this is the watch I ordered. It just didn't come the way I have paid this for to be. Uh, even the packaging wise. So it's basically, it's a laughter in the face. It's like saying to me, fuck, fuck you, basically. And that's it. So we have another watch here. So everything is basically stolen, if you ask me. If, if you ask me, I lost the appetite for this order. It started nicely, uh, very, very optimistic, and it turned out dark. It turned out to be really, really shitty. Just the way London would want, and just the way the London paid for it. Well, at least Charles is not going to say that... I did not buy the watch I wanted or something like this, that it was nothing, that I couldn't do anything or something like that. It, it came out that he's a thug, a thief, a criminal, a low life. And that's what matters the most here. It was not, uh, it was the London British that would do this stuff in the end. It came out clearly that they financed the stuff that was beyond insane, beyond criminal. But they finance, did not pay for it. They have stolen throughout my life absolutely everything I purchased in my life. So it was not that they would finance something or pay something. For this sale from AliExpress, it was a British Prince William who claimed that he's going to make a sale that would allow me to purchase the watches really, really cheap, that he will be the one who will finance this sale, that it will be 20, 30 minute sale. Mm, not likely, because the sales like this were done by AliExpress throughout the years, 
and it became evident that the British royals are total scumbags. Total scumbags, I mean scumbags, kings of the scumbags, yeah. Scumbag kings, I agree with that. So here, there you go, we're going to do this. Even if he would make such a sale, this is not his money. There is nothing. He have stolen the money from me, even from the online income. Even from the fucking YouTube, from Daily Motions. The, hey, these people ripped me American citizenship. They fucking destroyed me absolutely everything. Make sure I would not have ability to file for protection anywhere across the Europe. Western Europe. I'm not going to say Eastern Europe. Because it's other people that enforce crime over there in cooperation with the London, but definitely throughout the Western Europe, Canada. And well, they made the life in the US very much impossible. So there you go. I would I would say to you guys, any watch you like, go for it. Every one of these watches is great. That's basically the way I feel about it. It looks solidly packaged, this stuff looks packaged solidly, and we're going to do this, and let's go. We're going to start here, like this. I do not believe any watch today that I, that I got by the mail. No watch is new here. I don't, I don't settle not even for one single watch here, because none of these watches is new. This is the final verdict of this uh, watch purchase uh, combination. I was looking so much forward to. And we have this watch here. Let's see this one. Let's see if we can see anything here. Aha, this doesn't have, this have only one pin here for the belt. Um, I can see through the vinyl, however, already it's dirty and uh, it's going to be a problem. Yeah, it's not new, basically. This is not, this is, you know, the watch is about, when you pay for something new, it's about getting the new watch, right? <laughs> you don't, you don't go and do this stuff, you don't go, you wouldn't go and fucking do stuff like that. Would you go and buy stuff like this? I don't think so, basically. What about if I give you this stuff for free? Well, the thing is that I'm not here to get anything for free, I pay for it. This is the thing. In Britain, they do it like this, but the rest of the world is trying to stay away from that. So we got another watch here. Um, this watch. Oh, through it looks like new, it's not. It's got marks here. Look at it. Marks. Yeah, this is probably the guy from the British guy, this watch. Uh, because uh, it's fucked up. Because he said exactly what I see based. Because I was eager. 
and he said that he would use watch on you a little bit and so on uh, so it could be this watch is actually even from Britain use watch from the guy I eventually already even demonstrated you on the internet you see those scratches right there on the belt you can't go past that so apparently the British deemed that this is just okay for me that's fine and so that this is okay like that have this kind of stuff here like this He would just he would just use it a little um, he is not completely British he is maybe I don't know or Egypt or something like that so it was a really really stupid thing to purchase it it was a stupid thing to purchase because you know the British you are fascists you already know you're neo-nazi shit you know that so I should have known better than that. Not his fault, no. The guy has to pay the bills, basically. That's why I said that everybody, every everybody that is not native in Britain and even native British are fucking hostages in that fucking system. It's not his fault. I don't blame him for it. He had to do it. He had to agree to their royal, it's really royal, isn't it? Terms of negotiation. No. A British fascism, basically, classic. You see that scratch right there? You can see it. You can see that scratched. I knew immediately it's going to be a problem. It even looks like decolorized or something like that. Like is as if you would put something on it that would eat the color. See it. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Aha! I know what it is. It's just a white thing from this white thing. The color, the paint. Uh, strange stuff. Strange. Mm, I doubt they do it like this in the factory, that this is what this is. A lot, a lot of fingerprints. Um, actually, the surface is quite nasty, really. Uh, I did not expect this would be the case. And um, the surface, um, here you can see the watch is being used from the side. The surface is being already partially scratched, uh, fucked up, uh, so to say, done in a such a way that it would go very bad as soon as possible, that it would not last. Uh, the biggest problem with this watch, see what I mean right there? The biggest problem with this watch was discoloration. Uh, this watches would love to get the colorated, discolored, right at the top. They had two problems, this watch, during MK Ultra when they tested one. One problem was that they would be breaking the glass. This watch, I think, opposed to other watches. I'm not sure whether it does have a glass or not, and finally it doesn't matter, because this, this is the plastic that allows you to go under the water uh it's stronger it's thicker i understand etc etc so this is the stuff you see this stuff here on the on the surface 
this is what I think they did go over with the alcohol. Uh, because this is what's used actually to fuck up the, the surface. Once you do that kind of stuff, it starts to decolorize itself. And the only thing that happens is it will just, the paint will just go off and then it looks nasty. This was the biggest uh, problem with this watch. This is far from new. Uh, not only this watch is not new, but also this watch is prepared to fall apart in my hands within maybe a month or two or something like that, like totally getting totally rapidly, basically losing color, decolorizing itself, turning itself in shit very, very quickly, basically. I would not even uh, doubt about this watch being possibly even painted over. The watch has a visible scratches. Uh, cracks uh, you can see that right there they don't make the watches like this the new watches don't look like this I'm sure you can see it very 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 nasty watch really really nasty the screw uh, it appears that somebody was also having trouble with all in all somebody was uh the screw definitely somebody was having trouble with the screw and you can see they are in a wrong position. See it? Mm, totally, totally nasty stuff. Nasty stuff, really. Nasty stuff. Uh, okay, maybe two watches are okay. Uh, other than that, this is this is fucking nasty. This is horror. This is totally horror. I, uh, I actually regret the purchase of this stuff. No, I did not know I would say this. I do, do, frankly, I regret this purchase. It brought a lot of headache. Really brought a headache. I would feel much better right now if I did not purchase the watch. The watch clearly also, if you remove the sticker, which I am not going to be doing, somebody else already did, also has a scratches. Definitely was a used watch. Definitely is a used watch. Definitely is a used watch. I don't have, you can see when you see those lines running, not uh, like a sideways and stuff like this, that's, those are scratches basically. That's, they're not big scratches, but this watch was used by some timid individual. Congratulations, you have made it to the end of the part number two. Uh, the part number two, that's all there is. Uh, in a part number three, if I welcome you, it's where I welcome you. Uh, make sure you watch part number one of this video because this is where I most realistically do the breakdown of basically what went on. Uh, part number three is the one you may want to watch. Actually, part number one is the one you may want to watch to understand basically what exactly went on. Part number two was just to demonstrate to you that it was authentically open, that everything was done according to police criteria uh, for a proper investigation procedure uh, purposes. 
uh, but truly part number one part number one is the part where i explain everything to you in detail i'm sure you have filled my negativity in part number two because i was uh, i was under the shit impression about the stuff that went on due to those stickers that were in the back but once we removed those stickers just as you have seen in part number one condition of this watch is more or less somewhat satisfy criteria of the new watches condition of the new watches with exception of two watches basically the one from british egyptian guy and uh, well this watch right here which is damn it's really shame because it's a, such a pretty watch with a five bar resistance and it's exactly why they have done something like this so that i could not hydro mode one and use one also for swimming so Part number one is what mostly explanation for this stuff, for this procedure, for this, uh, for this crime uh, is done. Now, in part number one, you're going to find the explanation. So I'm going to say thanks for watching this video. Till next time. The watches that I reviewed today, um, they come as follow. Uh, they come as following, basically. Uh, 8007, 8007, smile, smile like smile, smile. 8007, these watches I was told by the Chinese and by the Japanese. 15 years, I remember. Slovenian side is, these are fuckles, assholes. They're assholes. It's not five years, I remember. It's 15 years, about 15 years. Will they told me it's gonna go something like this. Should work if it's the way it should be. I think 15 years is what they told me. 15 years, like minimum, this watch, as long as it's new, taking care and everything, this watch should last you for 15 years. Uh, In a little bit, I'm going to also tell you, no, this is a, such a disinformation and you know, such a damage you can do to the factory uh, by saying it's five years when in fact it's 15 years. That's like a big, big difference. If I tell you it's going to go minimum 15 years and if I tell you it's going to go five years, that's a big ass difference. Uh, with this Japanese mechanism inside, I understand I was told 15 years this is going to run you. Uh, 80 8007 would be this model and i think you get with a button if you want also extra button for the light here you can also order that its model is 8007 um no uh 80 whatever 80 and i don't actually know i think it's something like this not sure 8007 is this one here all right they have models that also have the button right there or whatever but i don't remember the model honestly i'm not going to lie to you i don't know the model um in continuation one that i'm going to do the next i actually do know the model so that will be 8007 just the same model as the other one kind of a gray white with a blue face is why i ordered this one here usually these watches do like to come in a darker um like you know um dark stuff and you cannot even you're not going to have a chance to change even if you change the belt or whatever it is uh, <clears throat> the housing it's okay if it's if it's a little light like this it's it, it it gives you like a little positive energy i think okay so the two washes that you see here 80 07 8007 really really pretty pretty watches i do want to thank my friends my chinese friends and also japanese friends 
for these watches. I do want to thank them and I will take this minute extra to thank them. In the world of sports, I know for Anthony Joshua was playing with this stuff. Um, and who else was playing with this stuff? Everybody was playing with this stuff. I know there was a bunch of these people, a bunch of these sportsmen, they would, they would wear these watches, they would wear these watches and they were really impressed with it because they told me for the stuff, for the workout and for the stuff, this is just like myself, basically the same thing, the same mentality. This is like a green, like a, I, I would say like a super outdoor watch. You know, if you like the outdoors, this is a killer. This is a must to have. If you like the outdoors, then this watch is really, really a must to have. This would be your smile, 8086, 8886. And I think it's an 8087 that comes also with an extra button that the watch would have right here, something like this. And that you would squeeze that and it would also give you a light. I don't like that. Uh, most of the people, however, liked it. But I don't like it because I plan on having the battery for two years. <laughs> uh, so this would be this. Then we have this one here from my British Egyptian friend. You see this one here. He stated this would be also good for a business meetings and sometimes this is a good man. I will be honest with you. This is watch for every, every, absolutely every occasion. This one is 86 T 8060. 8060. Uh, this is just for about the way I see it. This is watch for every day. You're never gonna get ever gonna get tired of it. I like this the way they are designed in the back. It gives the impression the watch is much much smaller than what really is. And you gotta word it. For that with a big face beautiful uh, ability to clearly see the time whenever it is that you want because of these things here see because it's designed in a such a way that the watch is like around like this and so it fits on your hand because of this here it's much smaller also and will not even give you a problem with the shirt because it's designed also in a such a way. It's also designed like this, you see? So the shirt is not gonna stuck or anything like that. I like that too. Simply thickness wise, I measured 18 millimeter, 18 millimeter. I would also go with 18, even that they claim it's 16, it's not. 18, 18, 18, 16. We are now at the part what you should not consider as a crucial, but people consider this, including myself, till I figure out basically what went on. And in the last moment, I changed my mind. I was gonna order three watches like this one here, which is actually 18 millimeters, as you're about to see. The same thing. This, when you look, this is about, frankly, this is 18 millimeters. Look at that, also 18 millimeters. Just about also 18 millimeters. And the last one for my British Egyptian guy, that one I would really give 16. 
So what not to consider is the thickness. Don't worry about the size. You'll be all right. You're all set. And yeah, these are the watches for every day. For whatever it is that you need to get it done. And I guarantee you, whenever you're going to look at this, you're going to have this on your hand. You're going to feel like you have a watch, a real watch. For uh, Sundays, for your church meetings, however, so that you can look chic and or to get robbed, uh, buy a silver Rolex. You know, once a week, you deserve it. Um... I should say once a week, those that are going to steal you one or find one are going to deserve it. For everything else, to get the job done uh, and to be pleased about it, to be satisfied when it comes to time, if you are meticulous about, meticulous, if, if you're somewhat at least demanding about how you watch, uh, there's plenty of watches, I mean, there are good washes to choose from. I mean, if you like, if you like, I mean, you know, I, in particular, don't give anything on the Rolex. I'm just going to tell you, there's a bunch of companies out there that have those kind of watches. To me, they look dumb. You can't even see in the dark anything. I mean, what do you see? I mean, if it, they do have that glow feature, which, let me demonstrate to you. This watches also have it, at least some. Uh, we can see that stuff too. Why not? All right. So this one here does. Uh, let me see something. This is still not dark enough so that one it does, two, three do. Uh, let me see if I can get also. Well, with a camera, this is very, very difficult. It's rather not impossible to. Let me see if this, this this one this one doesn't. This one really doesn't, but other watches do have uh, that ability for you to literally see in the dark. Uh, the pointers, the pointers can be seen also in the dark, and that's that's really chic, man. That's that's really really nice. I like that. Let me see if I can. I don't know if you can see it. Hell, it doesn't. It doesn't look like I'm gonna make it with a camera. This stuff, uh, but uh, that will show you know. Yes, even this kind of stuff that you can clearly see. A little bit, you can see pointers. Uh, the green one, you cannot see. You cannot see the green one. This is the stuff. This one does not have at night, but it sure is elegant. And you can use the backlight anytime you like. All right, I'm going to do it. I don't like doing it, but I'll do it. I, all right. Um, this is what the watch, if you like, if you want, if you're crazy about Rolex, this here, I think, it takes one away within, within, within immediately as you see it. It's gonna take you. You will. You won't. You will. You will not want your Rolex anymore. Eighty eighty six would be the model for this one here. Eighty eighty six, nice outdoor watch, real outdoor watch. I wanted to have an outdoor watch, and now I have more than what I bargained for. You can see at night clearly the pointers. You don't even need to use the lamp that looks like this when you when you turn it on. The same thing. 
8007. And this one here, 8086. Super, super, super clearly, you can see uh, pointers, hands, you can, you can see them clearly at night. Beautifully, you don't need anything to see them. This is actually 8060 is this one here, 8060 is this one here. All right, that's that. Smile and keep smiling. And I'm gonna say again to my Chinese friends, thank you. So let the thickness not worry you when you're buying these watches. Uh, choose according with whatever you like you see on the, on the computer, say when you order this through the internet. And make sure you video record this stuff. This kind of stuff should not go on anywhere in any country around the world. It's not okay. This stuff is not okay. This has a spectacular uh, watch band. It's a very good watch band. Um, really, really beautiful special. And the watch itself is really nice. This is not a stick, but <clears throat> probably is a centimeter have to break down this one okay let's do it damn it this is like uh, one 12 12 millimeters really a wow 12 millimeters for this one uh, but also feels this this feels like a small watch uh, five bars um okay maybe i do that too i'm not gonna do it people paying freaking money to get original on a casio to get original uh like it really is. It's a metal case. They change the plastic. They put the in watch into the metal case, and they have the metal band, and they pay I don't know how much money. This watch goes for a few bucks. I don't know how much this watch actually goes for. Uh, we can we can do that. We can check and see basically what these watches are going for. This is the special they're running right now, 664. If you squeeze yourself and you get this kind of special, you're not gonna be sorry, man. And I can also give you a little bit about the order that I have made. The order is this one here. It goes to March 14, 2024. The merchandise arrived to me within 11 days. And that included the weekend, 11 days, because somehow it came on a Friday. There is absolutely no complaint it can be. And this is also what I was told the case is going to be. I go track this. It came so rapidly, this, this, this order. That it was unbelievable the way this, this, uh, I never got anything so fast. Actually, yeah, it did came. Also, other stuff that was not important also came fast. So, this, according to the police already, it would come very fast. But, what's uh, interesting is, uh, on March 24, it was delivered indeed. But the thing about it is that on March the 24, March 24th definitely was not delivered, uh, but March 25th was really delivered. I got one on on March 25th, yeah, but the watch arrived already here on Friday, uh, actually possibly even Thursday. Local company received one, they say, on a March the 21st, 
which is rather not really believable because they say March 20 was the one that arrived into the transit uh, country that basically in this case would be here since the customs were complete probably already in Hungary on a March also 20. This watch was in Slovenia already on March 20. And that was, holy shit, that was actually even Wednesday. That was actually even Wednesday. Then it was a lot of uh, misinformation here. That was a lot of misinformation then. And so in Slovenia, they play with this watch for about since March 20 all the way to March 24. So we're talking about one, two, three, four, five days almost that was in Slovenia before I would get one in my hands on March the 25th. That was on Monday. So this, this watch was so, this is so rapidly, this was so expedited. Um, AliExpress selection standard. And there you have it. <laughs> That's gonna cost you 11 euros. Right now you can still catch on special. 80.07. The same thing. This is also going to go for about 11, but you will also get this on special. They put this on special, it costs about 6 euros, something like this. You will also get that one. I have demonstrated that one already, that's 80, 86, and then you get this one. Just for 13 euros, there you go. They are big discounted now. And you also get this one here. 80-60. That one's a little bit more, whatever. 60% also discount. No, they're all the same. It's all the same thing. A little bit more okay and that will be it this is what you get from aliexpress this is what you get from chinese japanese cooperation with one another really really good stuff really 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 good stuff i highly highly recommend this stuff well, i'm impressed that's all there is to it uh, when it comes to this video Oh yes, one more thing I was going to say to you. Uh, there is a cost here for five watches that you see right there. I got these watches for just 9 euros and 28 cents. You too will get this for 9 euros and 28 cents. If you become a good AliExpress customer, uh, they do have a sales like this. I understand. I was told maybe even three times a year the sale will pop up like for 15 minutes, something like that. And whatever you have in the bank, um, this issue was involved in MK Ultra. Uh, then I only had 10 euros in the bank and instead of paying 19 euros i was gonna even spend on three watches i got five for just actually i got 10 watches for nine euros and 28 cents 10 watches for nine euros and 28 cents like this 
Five of them are still watching, waiting for me at the police station. We're going to go and pick up that stuff. And five are here. And unlike the cases before, yeah, I am going to start treating myself now. Because now I finally understand what exactly the problem was with all these issues, what they were doing to me. I do not even understand basically what, what the fuck went on when they were claiming me. Oh, well, you know. Uh, if I see you, I will not take my watch back if it's going to be scratched. You don't have to worry about it. You're going to go, you're going to get something else. You know, instead of watch, you're going to get the handcuffs. I'll set you, right? I'll set you free. Don't worry about freaks. We're going to make sure about it. But yeah, I'm going to start using this nice little uh, stuff. It's time. I think I start treating myself well. So that's all. That's all I wanted to say. Uh, go to AliExpress, get yourself something good, and stay tuned. Maybe you get lucky, and uh, you know you never know. And if you keep uh, video recording this stuff, maybe you get even luckier. Maybe uh, you double the watches at your police station.